it's an its fullness, right? So everything mm-hmm. that we have today, everything that pertains to this economy in reference to the land, it is of Christ. So it points to Christ. So the Christian is thinking of the possession of these kingdoms, of the activities, the controlling of these activities here on this earth. So I use the earth and land interchangeably. Mm-hmm. It's a space. And last, you remember in the book of Genesis, they were yeah. Adam and Eve was drove out of the Garden of Eden, right? Yes. That is Garden of Eden. People are thinking of that Garden of Eden just in terms of geography. But it's not only in geography, but it's also it's a state and a place of being. So in Christ, we are restored to that place of being where we met there yeah. with the truth of God's spirit. So it's all about place mm. and belonging and identity within that place. Mm. You, you, you touched on something about um, the Garden of Eden. And um, I, I, I see that, I remember one time I was, I was talking to a certain group of people and they said, if you think about it, Eden is uh is is let's say okay so if when they were in eden they were basically accessing they were like it was like there was a portion there was an access into into heaven let's say right there's a mapping there's a physical eden on earth which represents an eden of heaven and and you can see that in scripture and the best way I could explain it was that every physical, like physical actions have spiritual realities. Yeah. And spiritual realities have physical actions. So because it was in the Garden of Eden that God would walk with them in the cool of the day. And they basically was like all the raw materials were in the Garden of Eden. And then they were to take the development from the Garden of Eden and take it to the outer parts of the earth. Yeah. So, and I was thinking about it, that if you were in heaven and then you were experiencing a type of life and you talk and you said, okay, I'm going back to earth. Where can I continue to experience this kind of life? Uh, they would, they would, the coordinates they will give you will point to that geographical Eden. And now when you come on earth and you're in that geographical Eden, you will experience now a spiritual Eden uh, access. So it's, it's, it's very interesting that you're saying that Eden, you know, uh, how to look at Eden. So I think that was very interesting. Yeah. 